Good morning guys. It is Saturday, August the 8th and here in Tanzania it is Nanny Nanny Day which is day of 8 of August 8-8 eight, eight, Nanny Nanny 8-8 eight, eight. so every year on the 8th of August is Farmer's Day and um, there's an expo that they have in different locations of Tanzania um, we are the closest one to us is four hours away and because Chico and I are gonna be doing agribusiness we decided that it would it's a must um, go for us this today so we are on our way we were supposed to leave at, <laughs> at five o'clock but it's 6 20 now and we are just heading out um, we are hoping to get as much information as possible as far as um, contacts and um, contacts and um, and uh, for different um, aspect of what we will be doing so we are heading out it is 6 20 and we are hoping to um, to gain as much information as possible um, in the meanwhile I will be videotaping bits and pieces of our true um, journey there and while we are there so um, just in case any one of you guys decide that you have when you when you get here this is what you're gonna do it is something that happens every year and they have all the um, who is who in agriculture with the farmers and um suppliers buyers and all that good stuff so i will be sharing whatever information i get and i hope to see you guys in the meanwhile please don't forget to like subscribe and share our journey with your friends and for those of you guys who want to um to make that transition over here so we are just gonna enjoy the wonderful cool breeze this morning and until we get there and i will like i said it's four hours drive so i will be stopping and um show you guys a little bit of landscape of um tanzania we are going to morogoro right morogoro which is for hours from here before a few hours before you get to the um, capital which is the doma all right guys please like share subscribe we will be back so yeah we stop here at a rest area to get something to eat we had we got to use the restaurant which was really clean and now chico and isaac is getting chicken and what what you got what you got fruits what you got Oh, it's just you just greedy, eh? Yeah. Chico got chicken and me and I said that fruits. You order your fruits already? Did you, did you order? Yeah, we got two. Huh? And so they cut up the fruits for you. You paid already? So yep, everybody here, the kids are going to Nanny Nanny, according to what Isaac said. So this is the regular um, gas station, just like what we have a gas station in the US. They didn't have toys. They need a fizzy water. 
So basically that's it here. Chiguana is like still getting the food. You guys ready? Hmm? What the chicken? No, I don't want to. It's too early. I see they have some uh, mandazis and stuff like that over there and um, I think I want to get the one but I don't have no money no I want you to come with me I want Isaac come with me too they have coffee Isaac don't drink coffee oh so yep this is the stop area we got something to eat and we'll be back on our way Okay, so we have entered the site of Nani Nani. It's basically a game here. So we'll just start going inside of this way. So we're basically looking at chickens. So we'll be going inside of that first and then later on we will um we will decide what else we want to do. Is this the only one? This is a small um what is that? What is that? Huh? What is that? Oh, that's who we have to speak to. Those chickens and them looks kinda and you are the expert. You are a loser. Yeah. 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 We spoke explains everything from the structures. Yeah, but it's in Swahili. Okay, we'll explain to you. In English. So the book is gonna explain it to me in English? No, no, he's an expert. In the poultry. But Sorry. the book is in Swahili. The book is Swahili. So you don't, he don't have any in English. No, I don't have any. Oh, I just okay. want to explain you know, to take you through how the whole process is. 
Swahili, I mean in English. Okay. Yeah, it's a Swahili. So you can start, my friend. You want to know from which, which point, maybe? Well, basically, we just we are in a basic planning phase. It means you, you, you know nothing about this. Right. Right. From the beginning. Exactly. This what we are entering is um, livestock. The University of, the, of uh, Tanzania. Uh, they have all kind of different livestock here. They have rabbits, cows, sheep, wheat, goats, and chickens. So we'll look around here and see what's going on. Hello. Hi. Remember the guy was telling me about rabbits? And they do eat a lot of cabbage. one of the stuff that we are interested in this one here is fish farming no desire for that fish farm here yeah. big money no? I have no desire I think I have more desire more I would be more likely to farm pigs more than <laughs> This one here is Salomon. These chickens and them look nice and fat. Hello, Mr. Chick Chick. There's some big rooster. Okay, he's over there. No, that's a rooster. No, that's rooster, baby. <laughs> ah. All of them. Oh, okay. Each and every last one of them. That's a Santa. Salama interest here. You speak English? Yeah. You speak English? Yeah. Yes, he does. He asked, he yeah. told him that. Yeah. So here we are displaying how to make a structure for local chickens. I bounce upon this young lady here that sells natural product. I see she has onion shampoo. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Black soap. This is black coffee soap. Coffee soap. Coffee scrub. And she's located in Dar Salaam. So I will be contacting her. All 100% natural. Hon this one here is a vitamin E oil. Honey aloe vera, almond oil, and vitamin E. So I will be supporting this young lady here with her products.
that's it we are done we have collected some information on what we were looking for and now we are decided to head back so um, we'll be back it's uh it's about after two or minutes to three or something like that and so we are on our way back again i will share please share like subscribe to our channel we'll just be showing you guys a little bit of insight on tanzania and what we are doing here again thank you guys and have a good one talk to you guys later oh i'm tired